Hi, this is Victor from Suzuki of Glenview. I'm going to go ahead and show you the new 2013 Suzuki SX4 crossover. Now, the Suzuki put a new front bumper and grill on the new 2013 model. Some of the exterior features include daytime running lights, a crossover body kit with front fog driving lamps and the chrome surround. Uh, the Suzuki also comes with an independent McPherson strut front suspension. The crossover also includes 16 inch alloy wheels which actually give the Suzuki crossover its stylish look. The all season tires come included with a tire pressure monitoring system in case your tire pressure drops below 34 psi your low tire pressure will come on alerting you to add more air into your tire. It also has a front and rear ventilated disc with Bosch anti-lock brake system and gives the crossover better braking capability. Every crossover includes electronic stability control program with traction control system for better handling. Now looking at the back of the crossover, um, it comes with a rear bumper skid plate, okay? The uh, rear of the crossover also comes included with a rear window defroster and also a rear wiper and washer. Every Suzuki crossover also comes with roof rack rails for your outdoor trips. Now looking at the back of the crossover, you have your 60-40 split. Uh, you also have a cargo area inside with a storage bin and a cargo area light. Looking back at the trunk of the SX4 uh, crossover, you have a cargo area storage bin and also a cargo area light which you can actually switch on and off. On the outside, you have your dual body color heated 50 split mirrors. The SX4 also comes with eight standard airbags, which is among most of its class. Also comes with a remote keyless entry system with a panic function. The doors come with power windows, door locks, and mirrors, including with uh, front door bottle holders as well. Now I'm going to show you how to connect your phone um, using the Bluetooth setting. First, uh, we're going to start off with the main screen and we're going to select the phone option. Once we select the phone option, click on connect a phone button and uh, it's going to give you uh, three options, whether device, Bluetooth or friendly name. We're going to select the uh, device change button and it's going to give you the uh, phones that are available. Once your phone is selected under the Bluetooth discovery mode, it will display your phone's name on the connections. So we're going to go ahead and select my phone under Victor's iPhone and select the OK button. Now it's connecting through my phone right now and I have to click on the accept option on my phone. Vehicle is telling you that it's actually downloaded the phone book and you are connected using the Bluetooth option. Now, one of the features I love the most are the heated driver and front passenger seats, which will keep you warm in those winter days. So you'll see these two buttons, one for the passenger, one for the driver. All you gotta do is just go ahead and press the button and you'll see the light illuminate where it will indicate you that the seat is actually starting to warm up. Now, one of the features I have talked about earlier was the traction control system which you would actually see the button next to the driver and passenger uh, front heated seats. Now, one of the options that I have some of the customers always telling me is, how do I actually know if it actually it's working? So once we actually press the button and we have to hold it for two seconds to show on the instrument panel that it actually has been turned off. So you'll show once you actually press the traction control button and hold it for about two seconds, it will activate the light and it will let you know that the vehicle does not have traction control on.
Now you have the choice of a six speed manual transmission or sport tuned continuously variable automatic transmission with paddle shifters. Now under the hood is a powerful 150 horsepower 2.0 dual overhead cam with four cylinder engine, which will give you a better fuel economy. Now one thing that I actually do like about most Suzuki's is that it comes with a zero maintenance timing chain and you can actually see that once you open up the oil cap. We'll go ahead and zoom a little bit closer there. Now you see there is a zero timings chain so it actually adjusts automatically for you. 